For those of you that don't know me, I'm Remy. I started off uh, with YouTube in my little shed at home, just playing around with my cars, and now I'm in a brand new factory working on other people's cars, building stuff for other people, selling jewelry, car parts, sculptures, clothing, all sorts of things. So yeah, it's been a long journey. I've still got a long way to go. But yeah, I, I hope that you guys have really enjoyed watching me grow and will continue to watch me grow. And uh, yeah, it's been an exciting journey and I've had such a good time doing it with you guys. So I wanted to show you guys a bit of a recap of the things that we've been through over the last couple of years and uh, yeah, where we're going from here. Love to work on cars. I wonder where it might be from. I don't know. Maybe that. I like to go on adventures, get out and about in the outback and in the city.
And I really, really love giving back to the community who supported me. It's Remy here from Remy's Chop Shop. Find yourself 250 bucks. Thank you, mate. I'm going. I really appreciate it. You might be on the way. Oh, uh, my dad's not well at the moment. So I think that's why she entered you, to be honest, actually. I think that's Aww. what she said in her message, yeah. Yeah, thank you. That's emotional. Because <laughs> at the moment, it's like so hard to care for your friends, because like, what do you do? You can't go see your friends. Yeah. Five people gave me. Yeah, well, that's what... A few of the stories have been very, very touching. So from here, now that I have my new shop, I really want to focus on this this side of the brand, um, building up the car clientele, uh, customising cars and stuff. And then obviously, I really would like to see my uh, sculptures and custom furniture go somewhere. Obviously, the retail is good as well. Um, I've mainly got that in there so that you know when someone comes in for something else, they might buy a few other things, which just helps me get the rent paid here. But yeah, I really would love to just. Uh, I'm only in here three afternoons a week, but I just, you know, I would love to be fully booked out, working on custom cars all the time and showing you guys, because then I can create some cool content, show you guys what I'm up to. Um, bit of, bit of how-to videos, which is, I actually originally started a YouTube channel to do how-to videos, but I've, um, since I still do a little bit of that, I guess, but I'm trying to make it a little bit more fun than, you know, unbolt this door trim and then put the window regulator in and then, you know, just, there. So I wanted to do that. Everyone told me I need to stick to one genre on my YouTube channel, which is probably true. I bet you it would help the algorithm, but I'm hoping that one day uh, YouTube individually uh, pushes their videos. And once they do that, then it's good for me because I've just got the one channel that I can um, do all the different stuff that I do on. Because at the end of the day, you're watching me because you want to watch me, so it doesn't really matter whether I'm out on an adventure or working on a car or building a sculpture. It's just me doing stuff and, um, yeah, eventually, hopefully, I can get it to the point that I can have someone filming me again. I get my sister in every now and then to help me film, but at the moment, it's all on a stand and stuff, so it's harder to get all the angles and all the cool different stuff that happens. I'd also get a lot more bloopers if I had someone filming me, so, yeah, I want to build the channel up to the, the point that it makes some money and then... Um, yeah, I can hire someone to help me film. If you did like the video, please let me know by commenting down below. Um, yeah, I really appreciate you watching and uh, yeah, I'll see you on the next hundred.